What do you think when you hear Tourette's? What is it that goes through your mind? Do you think, what symptoms do they have? Or do you wonder, are they suffering? Tourette's is a serious problem in America today, and millions of Americans suffer from Tourette's, small and major. Tourette's is a disease in the brain, and it is passed hereditarily. No one has a choice for Tourette's. Tourette's is a disease. What is a tick? No, it's not a bug. There are two types of ticks. Number one, vocal ticks. These are sounds or words. Examples of these could be grunting, barking, hissing, sniffing, snorting, or even throat clearing. Number two, motor ticks. Physical body movements. Examples could be quick eye blinking, lip licking, head twitches, shoulder shrugging, or even muscle tensing. The tics associated with the syndrome can be extremely socially limiting, embarrassing, and all-consuming. Most people recognize this syndrome by its symptoms. Tics can come over time, varying in type, frequency, location, and structure. What people don't know is that most tics start in the neck or the head. How do you get Tourette's? Don't worry, Tourette's is not contagious, though it is genetic and hereditary, meaning that it is passed down from the parents and or the grandparents. If either one of your parents or grandparents have a case of Tourette's, you have a 50% chance of inheriting it. The genetic changes of Tourette's happen while you are a baby in your mother's womb. It is more common in men than women to inherit Tourette's. Where did Tourette's come from? This man, Georges Giles de la Tourette, was a French neurologist who studied in many universities. In 1884, people thought that Tourette syndrome diagnosed people were demon possessed, obviously because of the side effects. Courageously though, Georges stepped in and proved himself by describing the symptoms of nine patients and to this day, everyone refers to this disorder as Tourette syndrome. Doctors and scientists to this day are unsure what the exact cause of Tourette's is due to insufficient technology, but doctors and scientists will hope for the future. During the course of this presentation, how many have often wondered, who might I know who might have this disorder? Well, how many of you recognize these people? As you can see, some of the most recognizable people in our time have or has had this disorder. This proves that those diagnosed with this syndrome have normal life expectancies and normal intelligence levels. Despite our comical approach, Tourette's is no joke. Tourette's is a disease that affects people, millions of people, every year. Tourette's is a lifetime thing, and as far as we know, there is no cure. Next time you come in contact with someone who has Tourette's, be understanding. It's hereditary. They don't have a choice. Understand what Tourette's is and where they're coming from. Understand that it's not their choice. Understand also, they are a person too. Tourette's is a disease. <laughs>